Oh my goodness gracious, let me tell you the news My head's been wet with the midnight dew I've been down on my bended knees Talking to the man from Galilee He spoke to me in a voice so sweet I thought I heard a shuffle of angels' feet He called my name and my heart stood still When he said, man, don't do my will Go tell that long-tongued liar Go and tell that midnight rider Tell the rambler, the gambler, the backbiter Tell them the gods gonna cut them down Tell them the gods gonna cut them down You can run on for a long time As slaves, we used to dream of ancient heroes, fighting against the monsters of our past. The Sentinels and the Raveni, heroic warriors and titanic monsters. Fairy tales, or so we thought. Until one day, those fairy tales stepped out of myth and into reality, and we joined the ranks of those destined to fight back. Despite our best efforts, one by one, humanity's kingdoms fell. Now, only Delorum remains. The Raveni are coming, and they are as cunning as they are powerful. We cannot last forever. We must learn their secrets and make their technology our own. If we fail, they will slaughter every last one of us. Today, our fight for survival begins. Did I ever tell you the definition of insanity? Giant war machines. 
that just completely changes not only the scale of the game, but the kind of tools at your disposal and how you have to manage your resources. Mechs can run, they can jump, crushing buildings and blowing each other's arms off. Finally, we can get that visceral mech combat. All of that action generates heat. Heat can then actually start to damage the mech, and if you don't control it, it will actually shut the mech down to avoid the fusion reactor blowing. All of a sudden, you're a sitting duck on the battlefield. And the other axes that's kind of unique to mechs is stability. These are giant walking mechs. You have to make sure that they stay upright, because if they get knocked down, then you're a sitting duck again. There's all sorts of different kinds of tactical combinations between the mechs and the mech warriors, what the different capabilities are. Do I have this one, which is going to be like my long range scouter, and then be able to fire in remotely? Am I trying to do, you know, brawlers who can go in and really use melee? All of these things together really touches on the themes and the fun of Battletech. If you're a new player, if you know nothing about Battletech, but you like strategy games, we think you'll love Battletech.